Hey there, welcome to the LaFonte Classic YouTube. This is where we review cars, walk around them, show you the highs and lows, hit all the buttons, the lights, and take them for a ride. This is a 70 C10. It's a Chevy short bed truck. It's got a lovely orange paint on it. Some other nice features. Tune in, my name's Mackenzie, and we'll get to the covering. All right, guys, so I like to start off right at the front of these trucks here. Check out our grill. They call this, it's uh, known to be the egg carton front end or grill on the 70s. Our lights look very good. I like the black bit of paintwork around them, and they look rather good. Front of the hood in good shape. Our hood release is going to be right under here. And this one has got a V8 kicking under here. This is a Chevy 350 V8. It's got big power brakes under here. We've got power steering, a new carb, electric choke, some headers. Then you need to go and hit the road. Um, this unit is totally rust free and very, very dashing. Even got a new battery to, to take home with you. Um, I'll show you this closing up. Boom, boom, boom. Closes really nice, fits all very good. Let's take a walk down the side here. I'll point out a few things, like this set of trim down here really sets these off. Has an option back then, I'm glad this one has it. We've got some nice aluminum wheels and you see behind those spokes are some drilled and slotted power disc brakes, which is great. These BF Goodrich radial TAs look very good. They have a lot of life left. Have stainless mirrors. This one's option with the rear glass, man. Boy, oh boy. Now, when we talk about these Chevy trucks, there's uh, a lot of love for them. They're great platforms for street rides, hot rides, or just plain Jane cruisers. Um, the really, really desirable ones of the pack are these short beds. Some guys even take the long beds, cut them down. This is a factory short bed uh, two-wheel drive truck, which is pretty sweet. Ah, this one has a nice wood bed in here. And one thing cool too, that the gas tank fill is actually right there. So it's got a gas tank under the bed. Normally that would have been behind the uh, rear seat, which doesn't give you a lot of leg room. They've made that adjustment, so you got more leg room than your regular one. That's awesome. Got a, a nice bit of uh, stainless on here protecting it. I don't think I closed it all the way, but we'll fix that in a moment. Some nice polished up bed rails. Boy, oh boy. All our lights, lenses, bright work, everything looks good. These mirrors are sharp. Take a look in here. A red cloth interior, a nice wood grain wheel. Very good. We will dive into this interior a little bit further in a moment. First, I want you guys to hear it starting up. guys we are taking her for a cruise everything seems to be working really well we're doing about 25 right now um, the brakes feel good uh, this 350 it's got some headers on it. it accelerates pretty darn good and sounds nice trans is shifting smooth uh, let's see both of our indicator lights are coming on here you can see those in there and they do power right off on their own check this out this has a tilt column as well, which is a pretty nice option. Kind of makes this like a one size fits all, and especially with that tank removed, we got way more room for our legs. Um, this radio here, it's an old, it's original, you know, Delco AM radio. Unfortunately, it just gets uh, 
a bit of static. So the power's on, the power's there. You could definitely hook up a new one if you wanted to. Uh, that's pretty typical of a 50-year-old AM radio. Um, glove compartment there, our heater controls down below, cigarette lighter, and this lower higher speed control. Um, that is for the transmission here. And if you want to take her up a notch at highway speeds, that is how you would do it. You really don't need to play with it. I leave it alone. Everything is good. Um, what else? The visors look good. Not too many of these trucks got a headliner. And this one has it and it's in good shape. All the, the bright work around it looks very good as well. Hey, thanks for tuning in and making it to this point in the video. If you guys want to know anything more, give us a call, shoot us an email, whatever you want to do. That number is 248-714-2110. I'll put that, our email, all the links to our socials in the description. And then one thing too you might want to check out, I will link the listing to this truck on our website. That's where all the pictures are. That's where all the details are typed up. You can click through it all. You can even look at the financing options. We ship them worldwide, whatever it be. We can make it happen. My name is Mackenzie. Thank you guys. I hope you enjoyed and we look forward to seeing you soon. Like and subscribe, please, if you don't mind.